absolutely. It's a whole week of preparation. The city of Athens Parks and Rec helps us get it ready. There's so many people involved. Sheriff Mike Blakely helps us get it ready. And it's a big event. It's great for the community. And come get buddy with us. Now, what are you looking for when you walk over this out here? It's like walking over turf before a football game. <laughs> yes. We want, we what want, are you looking for? we want your feet to sink like this. We want your feet sinking. And this is just the start. By the end of the day, it'll be like mud soup. <laughs> How many gallons of water are used today? I don't want to think about it because that costs us money. <laughs> <laughs> well, expecting about 1,200 people today. Get involved in this. It's a wonderful time. Yes, come see us. Bye. What about mud wrestling? Oh, absolutely. We're all for that. <laughs> I guess that's what that's for. Uh, this is for, and also to wash the balls off, that way they can push So feet and balls, right? Feet and balls open. Okay, I got muddy. <laughs> Good All part of the job. the 31st annual Mud Volleyball in the same location. I think I was here 31 years ago for that at Channel 31 and then did another one. But he went there. Let's go. Man, we enjoy it. It's fun. Best thing in the world. Thanks so much, Master. Well, that was one way to describe the activity that took place last week in Athens at the annual Mud Volleyball Tournament. It's, it's filthy. It's wonderful. <laughs> it's like a, a complete body mud pack, you know? They're just not muddy enough. That's what hey. Forty-eight teams with names like Mudfuckers and Blood, Sweat, and Beers competed in the tournament. Team one, the Smooth Dudes. Team two, the Steel Case Mud Crew. Team three, the Rice Heads. For folks like Greg Hill of Huntsville, winning was the most important part of the day. What do you like about, what do you like about playing mud volleyball? Winning. <laughs> One of the hardest things about attending a mud volleyball tournament is remaining spotless. Obviously, some of us can do it. Others, like the mud puckers, can't. Right? Yeah, yeah. This year, it's the uh, 
third annual County for a Cure Relay for Life team sponsored by Morell Engineering, being this year's premier sponsor of the tournament. Like I said, this is the third annual Mud Volleyball for a Cure. And there are a lot of people out here today. There'll be well over a thousand people. It's going to be a beautiful, hot, muddy day in Athens, Alabama. But before we get things cranking, let's open with Epic Church, who happens to be right nearby, with Athens Pastor Kirk Pearson wearing an Oklahoma hat this morning. <laughs> that will lead us in a prayer. Kirk. I appreciate it. Let's go ahead and uh, pray. But uh, before we get started, I just want to remind everybody why we're out here. Yes, we're going to have fun. Yes, we're going to get muddy. Yes, we're going to get dirty. Um, but there is a cure that we're after. There is a cause that we're supporting. And uh, let's just keep that in mind that this is about caregivers. This is about families. There's not one person out here who has not been affected because of cancer. And uh, we know that cancer really does suck. So we're gonna do everything in our power and our ability by supporting this cause to make sure that it gets wiped out. In fact, we're actually going to a funeral uh, after the tournament today because of somebody who has passed away uh, because of cancer. So let's just keep that in mind. Let's go to the Lord in prayer. Heavenly Father, I thank you for today. God, I pray protection over these players. God, protect their head, shoulders, knees, and toes, and everywhere else in between, God, as they play. We didn't want no ankle injuries, no knee injuries. Let us have fun. God bless Epic Church's team, and uh, be with us today. In Jesus' name we pray, and everybody said, Amen. 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 Thank you, Kirk. All right, y'all please join us now for the national anthem. The flag is over there. What so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight for the rest. More important announcements this morning. Right now, I'd like to welcome Limestone County Commissioner Chairman Colin Daly to Mud Volleyball. He's not even muddy yet. Thank all y'all for being here today. You know, it takes three things to put on an event like this. Number one is sponsorship, participation, and volunteers. Without those three things, this couldn't be possible today. So if y'all see any of these people that are in the back of these shirts who have sponsored this, y'all thank them for sponsoring. And I especially want to thank Michelle Williamson and Miss Tammy Waddell and Alicia Sanders, they have worked tireless on this event, so everybody have fun today. Good luck. Thank you, Commissioner. All right, now it's time to welcome one of our dearest friends in Athens, the president of all the mayors in the state of Alabama and the number one mayor that we say in the United States, Ronnie Marks. Oh, Jamie, you won't do. Hey, thank you everyone for being here and on behalf of all of us from the city of Athens, I just want to welcome you and thank you so much for participating in this cause. 
Uh, when we said in the prayer, I know every one of the families that we know has been touched in some kind of way with cancer. It's horrible, and thank you for your participation. Thank you for what you do in this community. Have fun, be safe, and God bless each and every one of you. Thank you. Thank you, Ronnie. We'll take time out now to do a special presentation by County for a Cure Michelle Williamson for Ben Wiley and the Athens Park and Recreation Center. Ben did a wonderful job here for all the years he was here. Without him, all of this wouldn't have been possible. But here's Michelle right now with a special presentation. Thank you, Jamie. Before I get started on the presentation, I'd like to um, call everyone's attention up here to my left. We have several members that have joined us back from CASA, the original ones that brought this tournament to Limestone County 31 years ago, first tournament being in 1988. With us, we have Ms. Jennifer White, Ms. Helen Carter, Mr. Evan Thornton, Ms. Susan Riddle, Ms. Grethel Harlow, and Ms. Julie Murphy. Not only, ladies and gentlemen, have these individuals given of their time, their heart, their soul, their blood, their sweat, and their tears to this tournament, they've also given it to our county in so many different areas, and we just appreciate y'all so much. We couldn't give this award this year without having them with us. Also up here with me, I've got several of our team captains, I have Lieutenant Tammy Waddell from Limestone County Sheriff's Office. I have Mr. Blake Williams with us. I have Alicia Sanders, which is the tournament coordinator, which is also one of our um, captains. When we were playing in the Mud Volleyball Tournament this year, one person just kept coming, coming back to us and coming back to us and coming back to us, and it's Ben Wiley. The day after Thanksgiving last year, Mayor Marks got a call that we had lost Ben. Ben has been a part of this tournament for, he was with the city of Athens for 25 years, and this is the 31st year, so for a very long time for the majority of the tournament, as long as it's ran. So it was very important to us, not only to pay honor to him and his memory, but to also thank the city of Athens Parks and Recreation Department for everything that they do for this tournament, getting it ready throughout the week, every year. I know that um, in a minute, you're gonna hear from Mr. Evan Thornton of CASA um, to kind of give you their feel about Mr. Wiley and um, the huge hole it's left for us losing him. Um, again, Mr. Mike Robertson with your department mayor has been wonderful. Mr. Bradford, the new director, has been wonderful, allowing us to continue the tournament here. Um, we can't thank you enough. I know that CASA feels the same way that we do about your department. And um, I would like to real quick get Mr. Evan Thornton to come up here from CASA to say a few words before we do the presentation of the plaque that will actually be installed on the Mud Volleyball Pavilion. Thank you. Uh, we just wanted to acknowledge Ben and his hard work uh, through the years for the Mud Volleyball Tournament. If you guys know this just doesn't happen, uh, there's a lot of work goes involved in, involved in this before it starts. Ben uh, took ownership in that. Uh, the city, and thank you, Ronnie, and Mike, Mike has also been here since inception. So a lot of people have owned this uh, to benefit the community. What it supports and, and what it entails is a lot of hard work by a lot of people who love their community. If I can say anything about Athens, it's one of the best communities in the world. And Ben Wiley was part of that. He actually represented Elkmont, too. So don't want to forget that, but uh, if, you, if you're here and you don't know, look around and see what kind of work it takes. It takes you, at some point, uh, deciding you don't want to play in the mud anymore and saying, I want to give back to my community. And so I've got it. I've got it. Uh, nope, lost me. I've got hey, I was trying to brag about myself. I've got a couple of those trophies at my house, so I was a participant. I was a participant before I was a board member, and so we won a couple of them. But it's much more rewarding to give back to your community. And I know some of you guys, some are for Gadsden, and so wherever you are, you need to get plugged into your community and give back to your community. And so that's what makes a community great is the people in it that give back to the community. And Ben was the epitome of giving back to his community. So we thank Ben, Ben, and all his years of service. So thank you. Thank you. 
Mayor, if you could come up, please, and Casa, if you could come up here with us while we present this truck to the mayor. Okay. Thank you. It says, presented to City of Athens Parks and Recreation in memory of Ben Wiley, 1969 through 2018, in appreciation for your generous commitment, time, and support to Mud Volleyball for three decades, July 20th, 2019. Thank you so much. And say, those of you that knew and knew Ben, uh, what a great guy he was. And Ben would tell you he was nominated and was elected to the Sports Hall of Fame in Limestone County for his awesome play of basketball years and years ago. And we could not talk Ben into going to the award ceremony because honestly, Ben wanted no attention brought to himself. So he would say to us in a heartbeat, Oh, it's all of you guys. It's all of us working together. But that's very special for Ben, his family, and for the city of Athens. So, Michelle, thank you for all of y'all's hard work, and you got a, done an awesome job. Thank you. Thank you, Ronnie. Thank you, guys. That was a great uh, ceremony. Hey, a couple of people I want to uh, mention here. Aubrey's Lemonade Stand is set up right over by the pavilion over here. She does this every year. She was on our morning program the other day. Anyway, she's over there set up. I want to give a shout out to KAC and all the guys over there going live at 10 o'clock this morning. The sports show with Zach, Todd, Jay, Tom Cat, and uh, everybody else over there, especially Tim. He's the one that gets it possible to do it. So they'll be doing live at 10. Thank you all again. Also, Poplar Creek Missionary Baptist Church has got a presence here. So last thing I want to say before we get cranking, all teams need to be ready on your courts now. We will start playing at 9 o'clock sharp. It may be 9 o'clock now, I don't know. But thank you all for coming out on this beautiful and glorious day in Athens, Alabama. Have fun, get muddy, and let's play ball. Over at the corner of the pavilion, she's got everything you need. Also, Missionary Baptist Church is firing up the grill in just a moment. And i got to give a special shout-out this morning for the number one plumbers in the entire world. All-star plumbers right here that and great church members over at Lindsay Lane Baptist Church. Thank you all again for coming out. If you got any questions, look for me, Gloria, Michelle, or anybody. If you need an announcement made, you will also be able to see as much of this as possible on Jamie Cooper Television Facebook page later today. Again, thank you all for coming out on this glorious, glorious day in Athens, Alabama. Get muddy. Net four, Mudley Crew and Muddy McGee's. Net six, Slap It Back and Mud Stain Salad.
for sure. <laughs> Michelle. <laughs> yeah. This side, and I don't know who's the losers on this side. We're, we're just gonna call them losers. Hey, what's that, that big name over there with the mud all over? Anthony. Anthony, he's the team captain. Yes, sir. All right. When will there be a break? I walk out. Well, it'll have, have to be after after the, after the game. He's got to stay on the court as the captain. Oh, well, I can walk to him, though, can I? Ah, don't interrupt them. They take it serious, uh-uh. Well, I know. I'm gonna wait till they break. He'll wait. Yeah, I'll wait. I ain't gonna hurry, guys. Come up one night. Let's walk over here. We need to go play here in a minute. You ain't mighty yet. We're gonna play yet? Who we gonna play? We're gonna pay cheap. Slow and easy. We're gonna pay cheap. Slow and easy. Look at this dude over here. He's all in here. Oh, look at him. He's down. Yeah, he's down. He's down. He's down. He's down. He's down. That's a team captain right there. Okay, come on, come on. Anthony. Come here one second. Tell me about this game because you appear to be in it to win. Yes, sir, all, all the way. What is it you like about mud volleyball? Uh, just a uh, competitive part. Hey, Muddy, hanging out with friends. Number one off, find a cure for cancer. You got a chest bump. Yes, sir. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was worth it. <laughs> Good way to get dirty. Oh, gosh. Stop. I'm part of the story. Oh, my goodness. Stop. That's enough. I didn't All bring right, a let's towel. Find oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel the action. Hey, who's the best player on y'all's team? Me, of course. <laughs> I don't know what it'd be a thing. What's the name of your team? Right. Southern Care Slammers. Southern Care Slammers. Awesome. Nice getting muddy today. It is awesome. It is awesome. Thank you. We're Thank playing you. hard. Yeah. I kind of got into the action. I, I kind of got into action. Thank you. Good luck. Good luck. It will be. I need to hose off. Hi. <laughs> You can't come to a mud volleyball tournament without getting a little mud on you. That's true. Having been here many times since 31 years ago, 
I'm ready to go in at any time. All right. <laughs> any time. Church West Point Rednecks. Are y'all professional mud volleyball? Yeah. No Real professional. Yes. You look like it. What's the name of y'all's team? Mud Animals. What? Mud Animals. Y'all are all 
so clean. to extreme. <laughs>